Yo, what is happening, everybody? It's Miss Old 278. My name is Scott, and today we're we'll doing some Call of Duty Ghost, and it's on a Tuesday. Well, while well, I'm recording this right now at 8:55, it's a Tuesday, depending where you're watching this or when you're watching this, it could be a different day. But on a Tuesday, when I'm uploading this, it is a match where I play by myself on Call of Duty Ghost. And as you saw last episode, I was using the Remington, and then I switched to the M-Tar. The m will be what I'm using this game. So I got Silencer, or at least starting off with Extend Mags. Ready up, slide of hand, quick drill, dead silence, scavenger resilience, and then satcom guard dog battle height. I have got the circuit camo, which I bought. I am level 29, whatever procedure that is. I think it's third. That's my last KDs of the last five games. Let's go into the TDM game, and I'll see you then. Uh, so we've got strike zone on TDM. Finally, I found a game where it's actually not already started, and this should be good. Hopefully, I don't go bad for you guys. But let me know, what do you think of the, um, how they brought into the multiplayer, like the actual, like, say if you just search for a TDM, let me know what you think about, if you search for like a TDM and you get maps that, um, like the new maps, I think they should have like a, like a whole new different playlist for all the new maps, because bringing them into this, I just want the bare maps that they have in like the normal TDM searches, so I don't have to actually play all the other shit maps that they bring in, because really, some maps are alright, but I hate most of the other maps, well I guess, just because I get it takes a while to get used to, I guess. But um, yeah, TDM on Strike Zone. I'm using my MTAR class, and if you didn't see before, you probably should have. But there's a quick look there. Anyway, let's go. So this is one of the smallest maps in the game. So probably get a few rages out of this. Oh my god, I hate people. They get they get the best spawn there. So I just like get to look down. Otherwise, I'll oh, get out of the way. And I know, I know I can see people there, obviously. But I just didn't want to go with one of those gunfights who didn't get killed from the side. I'd rather one of those more people that flank around the sides and get killed like that. And this is like a really map, easy map to spawn. So they just sit there or over here. Someone is over there. And this is if I can come around the sides. Or not the sides, but like cut, like cut the corners, I guess. Hey, back. Well, at least we've got one of them there. 3-3, three, three, starting off decent. Hopefully I can bring it up to at least a positive KD, or at least a neutral. I don't want to play a game when I go negative. Oh. Yes, son. Good job, good aim there. And this is one of the rooms where they could be beautiful people. If I spit out my words, mate. People could be spawned anyway. People can spawn there, right next to me, right behind me. People run into this building every time. And there's always people around this area, so I just watch my back like any Call of Duty, but this is one of the- Oh my god! See, I know there's always people that's nice on this map as well, it's really annoying. There's people over there, there's shit spawn, look at this. This house is crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so lucky, I should have died there so easily. I'm just gonna sit behind here, or cover, from how I can get a quick kill here. No one's here, I'm gonna go back around the other way. Oh my god, I shouldn't have done that, I should have just run. I'm gonna see if I pick up a payback on this guy. Oh, that's my team. I'm just gonna seriously just have to see. Oh, there we go. There, I got the payback eventually. I'm gonna rush into this. Oh, not a good idea when I come around this way. There's a care package over here. Probably trying to bait people out, and there it is. And I'm, I'm actually not gonna run that way actually this time. I'm gonna come through this way. Even though there's people shooting from behind me. I'm gonna see if I can come around. And then someone else has got the same idea as me. I got it first. Hear people even though I don't even have a headset on. It's crazy how loud the footstep isn't like a freaking knife. What do you think about knifing in this game? Do you think do you, th do you like the knifing? Like it's a lot better than what Modern Warfare 2 was with the freaking lunge from like a five meters away. Well it's a bit of an over uh, overreact uh, over exaggeration, whatever it's called. And I'm the guy next to me, I saw him at the corner of my eye. I already got killed. But what do you think about this Call of Duty? A lot of people say, oh Call of Duty shit, but Really, it could be, and there's random people talking about random shit. And I'm sorry if you just heard that guy blow into his mic. I'm actually in a party, but I don't have my headset on, so they can't hear me, but I can hear them through the TV. Oh, there's someone up there, no, he died. And so, if my, like, my play style is a little bit defensive, you know, if you watch Ali A, you probably watch me if you watch Ali A. But he's like, he's matched like really good. Oh, God. Oh, my, why did I do that? But, um, his, his play is like really um, attacking, he just runs straight in there. Get beasted up, but I'm like more like a player where it run around the flanks. This guy shooting me, and I didn't get the kill, but luckily that my friend was there to save me. Well, not my friend, but like my teammate. 
but we just that come in there. We're going 12 to 9, which is decent. I went better the first game, but still, there's still time in this game. And having such a freaking small map, it, just, it doesn't go that quick. It, the match goes pretty quickly. Oh my god, the Bulldog. The Bulldog is such a beast shotgun. Wait for him to see if he comes around again. Oh my god. I just dropped like easy kills there, and he's going to come around again. I, I can tell you, and the next day it's going to be from this guy. I'm going to get to you. Probably won't be, but just, just thinking. Like, I can't see through there though. Like, oh, well, I can sort of see, but my accuracy is just terrible there. Sorry about that. But if you if you do have any tips of how uh, I can get better, the game like just watching by watching this, it'll be very, very helpful. Also, like I said in last uh, my last COD gameplay, what headsets? And I let me I'm just letting you know that I have a Triton 720 plus 7. Point one, but if you don't know already, I did say I think oh, that was terrible accuracy. See there, I just choke I think at the last minute. But like it did break, and um, yeah, my headset's broken because when I used to play in the rumble stream, which is like just get like I guess like games, you could call it. Um, when I, we only had the one Xbox with my brother, um, like I, it was like all caught everywhere. I stood up to go somewhere, and then. The, the thing, the box fell down and then it just broke, like, I can still talk to people but I just can't hear sound. And this is the game winning kill, I think one, I went decent, I went 16 to 14, so at least it's not negative, but it's not the best. So this is basically one of my normal games, 16 to 14, I'm a little bit over positive, but my AKD actually doesn't show it. It says I'm negative, so yeah, tips would really help, but yeah, I, I got asked to give a shout out to one of my friends, YouTube channel, Will Archer 25 his name is Andrew. Go check him out if you like Battlefield 4 and um, like any like PC games he does sometimes, but ma mainly Battlefield 4. And yeah, he's a good YouTuber, pretty entertaining to watch. And yeah, you should go check him out as well as a shout out to one of my friends, Curtis, as well as another one, another shout out to James. He always like he always loves the shout out, and he's one of my biggest fans. But anyone can change that. Also. I'm on my road to 150 subscribers, so if you do see this and if you're new, hit the subscribe button, it'll really help. Also, give me likes, and the likes um, will really help as well. I'm also trying to get a partnership with um, Social Blade, so hopefully you guys can help my views up and help my way up to getting actually YouTube money. Like, yeah, get the YouTube money! But um, yeah, shout out to shout out to show Social Blade. They're a pretty good network. I know one of my friends, XX. XGG or X General Gaming or whatever it is, I'll link I'll link their this um channel in the description. They have like 3,000 subscribers. Two of them are actually my soccer team, and one of them is just his friend. But they do they do Minecraft videos. If you haven't checked them out, go check them out. And give a subscribe and say Mr. Doctor Seven Eight Army was here. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm calling you guys. But anyway, um, this has been Mr. Doctor Seven Eight. Hope you liked this video. Remember to comment, like, subscribe, and I'm out. Peace.